Last season, the Voorhees Vikings reached the North 2 Group 3 sectional title game for the third time in school history. This season, they say their strength will be both in their defense and their returning QB, George Eberle. Eberle is being recruited by some major Division I programs, but not as a quarterback, rather a punter. We'll speak with him and a couple of other Vikings to see how they're preparing for 2018. George is a leader, um, even as an underclassman last year, he showed uh, incredible leadership skills on our offensive side of the ball. He spent a lot of time this summer working our young kids out and building the trust in them, and uh, we we're looking forward to him being as good or better than he was last year. You know, I just think like one game at a time, we can't get too caught up in rival games, big games. I think we're more technique. We rely on technique because we play teams that are way faster than us. If I stay calm and composed, most likely the new guys are going to stay calm and composed, so I think we'll be good. But George isn't the only Eberly who feels he has leadership responsibilities this season. His twin brother, Charles Eberly, leads the defense as a returning outside linebacker. Last season, Charles had 115 tackles and three sacks. He tells Jersey Sports Zone about this year's team motto. Tradition never graduates. We want to stay, I guess, as a team, the same tradition that we had last year, making it to the state final. That's kind of shown throughout this, the camp we've had so far this year. And hopefully this year we can win it. While the Eberly boys take hold of their leadership roles, primary running back Athen Megalio says his goal this season is to be a 1,000-yard rusher. According to Megalio, his former teammates taught him that having high expectations is what it takes to reach a sectional final. We're going to need to work just as hard, if not harder. We had a lot of great seniors that graduated, but they really taught us a good work ethic. Defense is really the staple of our team. I mean, that's been our best part since probably my freshman year. So I am the defensive coordinator, so I put most of my emphasis on the defense. Most of our players play both sides of the football. I'm always going to say if we can shut the other team out, we can't lose. Voorhees, like so many others this season, is preparing for an early start. They have a week zero matchup against Plainfield on August 30th. From Voorhees, I'm Courtney DuPont. You're watching Jersey Sports Zone. Want to see highlights and features from your favorite school? Jersey Sports Zone is entirely supported by our great sponsors. Email marketing at jerseysportszone.com to get your business in front of our loyal audience and highlights from your hometown.